But hey, confident young dude, good on him. But I'm sorry, mate, I'm coming for you. I know no human alive by themselves can make me feel like that. <laughs> uh, so I came in last Sunday. So I came in. For, I'm coming for a couple of weeks to uh, spar Volk and have a like, little bit of a wrestle with them to try to give them like the best look I can for Ilya. Uh, me and Ilya are like kind of the same build, kind of the same height, and both like to throw a lot of hands. So it's kind of a good um, training partner for Volk this camp. And uh, yeah, he looks looks as he always does. He looks really good, really strong, you know, really focused. It's it's like uh, yeah, just just normal Volk, man. It's good to see. Happy New Year, 2024. Looking forward uh, to what's in store. So uh, obviously, I've been in camp. Uh, went from 2023 camp into 2024 camp. Started uh, nice and early. Started like um, what 12 weeks out. I think I started. I usually do about eight week camp, but uh, I wanted to start a bit early because uh, I wanted to have a little bit of a Christmas break which uh, I was able to do even though I was training anyway, but it was a bit of family time. I had a little break, so I sort of halved the camp. So uh, overall, did more weeks than I usually would, but I got to halve it. So it's not like uh, I did 12 weeks straight and you're, you're over camp by the end of it. I was able to do like four weeks, um, have a little break, and then still have about seven uh, weeks or something like that, um, however it works. But it was good, it was like, a, it feels like a refreshing start to camp, even though I'm already fit, I'm already strong, I'm already in great shape. Uh, it was good to sort of have that break uh, with the fam over in uh, Fiji just for a quick visit. But uh, yeah, so it's been, it's been good, training's good. I've got Brad uh, Riddell over, uh, who's uh, obviously a great training partner uh, just in general. But uh, even stylistically, he's obviously a very good boxer himself. Um, I think he can uh, sort of simulate uh, Ilya. Uh, I think he can do a, to be quite honest, I think he can uh, give me a lot more problems uh, than what Ilya will. And that's not knocking Ilya, that's just showing uh, you know, how good uh, Brad is. Um, obviously Brad's had you know, hundreds of kickboxing matches and, and had a heap of uh, boxing matches. So any strong, powerful, stocky dude as well. So it's good to have him in, uh, getting the rounds with me. Obviously they've got a lot of uh, guys coming in. Uh, looking forward to it. So uh, camp's going good. Camp's going strong, just did a spider. Uh, I've already done a few of those. Usually I just start them now, but I've already done a few. I've already done a fair few uh, fight simulators uh, that again, usually start right now, but I've already had four or five weeks of them in the bank. So it shows you that I'm taking this fight serious. I'm taking Ilya serious. He thinks he's a man. Uh, let's see if he is. I'm ready for the best version that turns up February 17th. So let's see what we have installed. I'm going to be ready either way, so uh, I see he's confident, he's a cocky, uh, confident young dude. Uh, let's see if he can really bring it, because I know I'm going to. And uh, yeah, I can't wait to, to show him levels, you know what I mean? Uh, I've seen a lot in uh, my game, I still feel like I'm in my prime. And uh, I get to show uh, this young kid that there's levels, and I am the king of this division. And he ain't taking nothing from me, I'm coming for that zero. I'm coming for his, what did he put on his uh, Instagram? I think that people are telling me he's put a, that he's a champ, he's 15 and 0, whatever it is. I'm looking forward to having to see him change that back to 14 and 1 and non-champion. Uh, man, that's going to suck. That's going to be embarrassing for him. But hey, confident young dude. Good on him. But I'm sorry, mate. I'm coming for you.